Hello, hello. And that just made it worse. Uh, whoa, that's a way to start, I guess. Holy crap. So, guys, we're at it again. We're going to try the chicken paprikash. I wonder if I could just cover that somehow. But then we won't have light. So, we're going to try the chicken paprikash thing again. Because I got crushed tomatoes. So, we need 15 ounces. All they had was a 28 ounce can. So, yeah, that's going to be fun. But we have that t this time, so we can actually make it. Let me pull up the rest of the recipe real quick. Okay, easy chicken paprikash. So let's just start by pulling everything out. So we need oil. Oil. Hello, Gio. Wait, right? Yep, Gio. Hello. How are you? Oh, I don't think I showed you guys this. I got salt and vinegar. Oh, that goes everywhere. I got salt and vinegar seasoning. And it's delicious. You gotta cover, when you cover stuff, you have to cover hardcore just to get it to flavorize. Okay, so let's, let's turn this towards the fridge, because why not? So we got oil, we gotta get the garlic chicken. The garlic and the chicken. Garlic, chicken. Good. How's your trip? Salt peppers right here. Need onion, bell pepper. Pretty sure it's still good. Pretty sure. Onion, bell pepper, little small one. We need the paprika and chili flakes. And chicken broth. Is that the paprika? That is pap. What the hell? What the hell? There's almost no paprika left. Look at this. Where's all my paprika? Damn. It's going all right. It's not too bad. So what are you doing up there? Are you just visiting something? Got crushed tomato. Needs sour cream. And we need flour. I did not know we need flour. Sour cream. Got plenty of that. I made sure of it. Oh, I also need to pull out the noodles. Oh, I should get the the pot going with water. Oh crap! It didn't get cleaned last night. Shit. 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 We got that pot. Crack. Zach didn't clean it like he needed to. That's okay. He must have been home late. I don't give him too much shit. Just do a quick wash out of this real quick. You have the family while your mom is looking at. Oh, your mom's looking at property? Is she planning on moving? Luckily, all I used this for was boiling water and more noodles yesterday. So pretty easy to clean out. Right off. So how far, how far away is that from where you're at currently? Like a good distance? Oh, I need to turn on the other light so you guys can see a little bit better. And I should have left the water on to get it real, real hot. There we go, there's a little bit more light. I don't know if you can see it, but right there, there's a tin foil plate. Yeah, tin foil, foil plate that has a lemon cake on it, and you know, it's pretty good. I'm not the biggest fan of lemon desserts, but it's pretty good. Oh, it's eight hours. Okay, that's not too bad. Are you planning on moving with her, or is it just your mom wants to move to a property? Why, why a property? If you don't build a house, or... I'm literally, like, between two cameras. <laughs> Eight hours is a good distance to have to drive. Especially when you do it every weekend. Okay, let's move this back over here. Get it going. Excuse me. Alright, I'm gonna start getting that boiling. 
Okay. So heat oil over medium, add garlic, chicken, salt, pepper, stir, cook chicken, add onion, bell pepper, cook until onions have softened. So we'll probably start by cutting the veggies, so then we can use the same thing, same cutting board. And I cut the chicken. Okay. So let's start by cutting the veggies. Move all this stuff out of the way, kind of. At least a little bit. Noodles I have over there, that works for me. She's looking at a house, but she wants large property for- Oh, cool! So she wants to do gardening, and she want, does she want like chickens and cows and stuff? And I just realized that I just put the camera directly in front of the other camera, so you're going to have a camera in front of my face for a little while. Unless I flip it to the other side, which I guess I can do. So it's out of the way. Flip it to the other side. There we go. Move chicken. Cord, you need to go towards the back a little bit. Oh, uh, I wonder if I should have put it on the... That probably would have worked better. And you're staying in Illinois, at least for now. You decide you won't move to Tennessee if ending... You won't move to Tennessee if you end up in a relationship. Yeah, she wants animals to help with some of her garden. Oh, that's cool. We actually are planning to do that as well in a few years. I am going to grab a bowl. These go in at the same time, right? Yeah, so I'm just going to grab one bowl. And I'll have to get a pan. Cow, chicken, pigs, that kind of stuff. Nice. I know we want to do chickens. I don't know about cows and pigs. I'm not going to turn that on for a little bit. Chicken, you could just move somewhere else. Like over here. Okay. Get rid of all these seeds. I think, and when we just, when we wind up moving, I actually might make another YouTube channel called uh, Grizzly's Homestead or something like that. <laughs> And I'll show all the stuff we do, like making our own alcohol and stuff, and growing our own trees, and planting our own plants. Bruh. So, you, are you there for another week, or how long are you there for? And what made her decide to move over towards that way? Like, so far away? I don't think I asked that part. Let's get these cut. No, get back there. Get back in the bowl! The bowl of greatness, because it will be made into a meal. Oh shit, I need to put up a pole. Not a poll. I need to ask who wants to enter a Cooking with Grizzly competition. I forgot about that for the end of the month. I need to do that tomorrow. Tomorrow. Another day. Tomorrow. It's only a day away. My right knee is kind of hurting right now. I think I actually did twist it when I turned around. It hurt really quickly. I was like, oh, it's no big deal, but it's actually still hurting. Yeah, she's been watching a lot of YouTubers who do homesteading. She's been passionate about it, and she wants to move here because she has a lot of family here, and she's happy. Okay, that makes sense. So it's not just like a random spot. Has she watched uh, White House on the Hill? That's who I've been watching. Holy shit, my hair is long. My hair's long. <laughs> I hadn't really paid that much attention until I looked and I was like, that's a lot of red on my head. Man. 
I think we put the knee braces. No, we returned the knee braces. Fuck. Because I needed to order different ones. For snowboarding, which now it feels like I need them for normal life. Ow! How dare thee, you damn me! Oh well. <laughs> we push through because we need food. But yeah, tell her to watch White House on the Hill because that, that's a good one. If she hasn't already. They're, like, they pretty much did the same thing where they weren't, like, far I think maybe their parents might have been farmers a little bit. But then they decided to do it. And so they're kind of figuring it all out on their own and stuff. It's kind of cool to watch. Oh, the water's actually getting close to boiling already. I was not expecting it to go that fast. I feel like I needed another pepper. I don't know, perhaps, but she watches a channel called Riots and Refugee. It's a Christian homesteading channel, and I will let her know about the channel. That one? No, I, I, I was about to say that one sounds familiar, but I'm thinking of uh, Weedem and Reap. I've watched a couple of their episodes, and they're okay. Oh, the water's already boiling. I'm not ready for you yet. I'll finish up this pepper and then throw it in. Are you interested in this kind of stuff, Gio? At all? Yeah, I hear you, Water. I know you're boiling. I can see you. you got a good boil going. What a good boil. Roots and Refugee. I feel like I have heard of them, actually. Riots. <laughs> okay, that makes a lot more sense of it being Roots. Wow, that's like, I'm going to have to turn the camera around just so you guys can see the spoil, because it's like a stupid perfect boil. Like, I'm not even kidding. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to unhook you from the wall, because that's obviously not working. Look at this boil. It's literally like the perfect foil. And I'm gonna go shove some noodles into it. We got spiral noodles. Spiralize. Sorry you didn't get typed right and it seems interesting, but you don't think it's the lifestyle. Nah. For us, me and Zach, I think we need a mixed lifestyle. That's enough, that's enough, that's too many. Man down! Man down! Uh, like, we love, we want to be on the computer a lot. We love playing on the computer stuff, but we also need to be able to, we want to grow our own stuff, so we need like a good mix. There's the pussy. That's no, 15, okay. I thought I had enough. Bill! 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 Hi! How are you? Do a backflip. I unfortunately can't do a backflip without probably breaking my neck. <laughs> I think I would hurt myself a little too much. How are you doing? I, I'm sorry, I can't risk it here. Maybe if I had a trampoline I would? Like, I won't lie, I would probably totally try if I had a trampoline, because I actually used to be able to do it as a kid. I also tried to front flip. That was a bad idea. That hurt. No. I'm not going to do that. Especially not in my house. If I ever decide to do a backflip, I will let you know. Don't worry. It will be posted everywhere. I learned how to do a backflip, and I broke myself. <laughs> Besides, my knee's kind of fucked up right now, so I may have messed it up. Meow, meow, Bill. Meow, meow. He's kind of hiding. I think he's just kind of hiding upstairs right now. I think Lovey's just kind of hiding upstairs. 
got him so scared with the coronavirus stuff that he's going to get. Because now pets can apparently do it. Indoor backflips are the coolest. What? I think the beach ones are cool. Because, especially like if it's on the sand. Because it's like, how do you get enough footing and enough push on something so soft to be able to backflip? The ones I don't like are on the side of buildings. <laughs> Probably because they're everyone's too afraid to hurt themselves. And I would be in that exact same boat. <laughs> oh, hello. Let's turn this down a little bit. No, don't. Don't do it. Don't do it. It's trying to boil over on me. Beep. Are you able to do a backflip? You're very interested in backflips, so I want to know if you can. There was a video I watched of, uh, who is it? They're called the Yes Theory, that's what it's called. And this guy, was it a front flip or a back flip that he decided? I think it was a front flip. I'm pretty sure it was a front flip that he decided to try. Okay, that's about a cup. That's going to be enough. See? I'd have to look it up, but he did one of the flips. And, whew. I can spin in a circle like this. Please. Kind of. <laughs> Not quite without almost killing myself. But how are you today, Bill? And how are you today? Man. <laughs> Besides the no backflip thing. Doing pretty good, at least. Oh, man. Eyeballs are burning. Like I got an onion. I wonder why. This in the sink. Ugh. Your back is already flipped. I feel like that's probably, I'm guessing you mean like inside your body. That's probably not a good thing. And I can no longer see out of my right eye. Which is my good eye. It's not a burning thing from that anymore. There's something in it. Ah, go down, you foam. Learn to relax. Relax, Lewis, relax. Pinch sight. Uh, that sounds very painful. Chicken, right there. Okay. That sounds incredibly painful. Is that something that just happens, or like you have to do something to cause that to happen? Either way, it sucks, but. Chicken. And a, one more chicken. That can go in the trash. Okay, let's get this chicken cut up real quick. You haven't cut just chicken yet, which is good. That has to go away. Let's cut out all the parts I don't like. <laughs> And make me want to gag. Like that piece. And that piece, because there's hard chunks in it. Blech. You're bleeding. There we go. That one's good. Not sure. Can't go to the doctor and most painful thing. <laughs> yeah. That's not fun. I have a doctor's appointment day after tomorrow. I'm not looking forward to it, truthfully. There's a hard piece. Hard piece of fat. Get away. I'm actually incredibly nervous for it. Because so nor so I get blood tests every six months. And this one came out a little odd. Well normally, when I get blood test results, they post it online. They had me get some more testing done, and they never posted it online. 
So I think they're waiting to tell me something in person. And you know it's never good when it's in person. So I'm scared. Oh my goddamn mind. <laughs> I've totally made way too many noodles, but that's okay. I'm going the opposite way of what I like to do on a chicken because I didn't feel like I had enough room from this side. There we go. Try and keep all the pieces about the same size. <coughs> Excuse me. But when some lose some, it will go away in five or six months, maybe. Hey, if it can go away on its own, that's good. It might. It sucks how painful it is, but at least it goes away and it's not like a lifelong thing. Hopefully. Preferably. Preferably. Okay. Keep cutting that chicken breast up. Chicken breast is the best kind of chicken. Except for if I if we make fried chicken sandwiches, 100% we do use thighs. That one does work better for it, which I am okay with. If not back, oof, back surgery is scary. I think no, my dad has probably definitely had back surgery. He felt when he was in a firefighting school, he fell off the roof and busted his back. And somehow he still was a firefighter for like 35 plus years. So, I say he did pretty okay afterwards. Well, I'm crossing my fingers you don't need back surgery because that wouldn't be fun and that'd be expensive and would just be sucky all around. Go, go, go away. Don't come back another day. We don't like you. Back pain. Die back pain. <laughs> I don't fucking know what's going on. I swear I don't do drugs. There we go. Get all that together. Okay, last piece of this chicken, and then I gotta stir those noodles up. I have a feeling that those noodles are actually gonna be overcooked by the time I'm done with this chicken. Hopefully not too much. Wish you had some drugs to do. No, no drugs. Bad. Drugs are bad. Drugs are very bad. No drugs. Unless you <laughs> need them. Sorry. I wasn't expecting this piece to be hard again, because usually it's not. I guess pain drugs would probably be a good idea for you right now, but just drug drugs? Nah. Nah. Drugs? No, drugs bad. Drugs very bad. Drugs make you lose your jobs. <laughs> Some drugs get you thrown in jail. Or rehab. Rehab is better. I think. Probably. Can, I guess it depends on the person and what state of mind they're in. Now, I should not walk my knees. That could wind up very badly. Especially considering I'm holding a knife in my hand. I got a plate of raw chicken. I need to turn on this stove piece and hope it doesn't melt my tripod. Probably just pull this off a little tiny bit and go like that. There we go. Now it's for the most part off the stove at least. So then it should not melt. It should not melt. It should not melt. 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 As soon as I get this finished chopping, I'm going to check to see if those noodles are done and drain them if they are. 
<laughs> and then they'll just have to kind of sit and wait until I get this all done and cooked. Oh well. You know, I might be able to do that whole can of crushed chicken, or crushed tomatoes actually. Because this is, I feel like this is more chicken than what it asked for. Well, I need to fix something. Let's turn that off. There we go. Ah, go away. Well, no, don't go away. Just get off of each other. <laughs> Apparently, I just want everything to go away. Just poof. Bye. Poof. Bye. <laughs> Okay, last piece of chicken, then we'll toss this in the sink for Zach to clean up later. I usually don't cook on Saturdays, so this is very weird for me. Okay. Let me check the noodles, because they might need to be drained already. Actually, while we're doing this, we can flip this around because literally everything else will be happening in this pan and pot. Well, it might be done in the pot already. Yeah, actually. Because actually, trying to grab through that actually makes them feel pretty hard still. Ooh, those don't feel... They're done. Well, maybe like a couple minutes. Like you can finish up as it starts, as I, as I turn off. <laughs> Heat the oil over medium. Add garlic, chicken, salt, and pepper. And I'll grab this to stir. Simmer, oh my god, I wish I had seen this. Simmer covered for 40 minutes. I might do 20. I should not have started that at all. Yep. Yep. I don't know if we'll go for full 40. Or what we might do. So it has the onions and stuff added second. We might actually do those first to start getting them cooking down, because I think that's what most of the 40 minutes is. But we'll see, we'll see. We'll, we'll mess around with it. Grant's having a movie night. Made your sister a giant burger platter earlier and made your vegan nieces some oven fries and made some hot wings. Oh, that sounds so good. I want some hot wings. Can I have some hot wings? Give me some hot wings. Ugh. There's a place we like to go called the Berliner. It's a German pub. And their wings are absolutely amazing. Let me get these strained real quick. So they don't continue cooking. <laughs> it's just wafting steam out of my sink now. I'm gonna let that cool down for a minute and then probably use it to hold the noodles again. If I had realized that, I would not have started that, but we'll probably not go the full 40. Wings all gone. I can't believe you didn't save any for me. Jeez. Okay, let's heat up some oil. There we go. A mm, little more. There we go. That's probably too much. That is probably too much. That is fine. <laughs> so what, what kind of wings? Like just buffalo wings? Just plain wings? What kind of wings did you make? Let that heat up for a couple minutes, and then we'll throw the onions and peppers in there. So we'll go out of order a little bit.
Who's that? Buffalo, that's a good flavor. The best wings I've had. Zach makes amazing wings, and my favorite what he makes are a uh, what is it called? Le uh, lemon pepper. God, we gotta make is that on our list? I think that's that's what we forgot to put on our list. I think that was what we forgot. No, it's on there. Never mind, it's on there. Wings are on there for our next couple weeks of food. <laughs> Okay, you ready? Yeah, I'm gonna say yes. Let's start with this, start getting it softened up a little bit. And then just a moment, I'll throw in the chicken, garlic, and that stuff. Check to see if there's a Nintendo Switch I can buy. Someone wanna buy me a Nintendo Switch? Because they're only like $500 right now. People are assholes. That one thing's going to be way down my way. Ah! Alright, so I'm going to make like a. I'm going to put this off to the side. I'm going to get the chicken in. You know, I'm gonna throw oh mm, throw a little extra oil in here. No idea how well this is gonna work, but we're gonna find out. Cause I'm hoping this will help negate that needed 40 minutes. Cause it's almost 8 p.m. So everything's gonna get like mixed together and together so that onion and bell pepper flavor is going to go into the chicken as it cooks garlic chicken salt pepper so we we'll garlic is that teepee ah there we go i needed all my strength to defeat that lid that's a good amount of garlic if I say so myself, let's do some salt and pepper. I'm just gonna do pepper shaker pepper, not that side, but that side. This is gonna be a very peppery dish, I can tell you that right now. I am gonna turn this down just a wee little bit. Pepper, 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 pepper. Because it has chili flakes, paprika, pepper, a bit of everything. Well seasoned. Okay. I'm gonna move the noodles out here real quick. Nice and should help keep them warm. And I poured some of them all over the counter. Everything's okay. On the floor. Mm. Here we go. Let's get this all mixed together now. Yeah, we might need that whole 28 ounces actually. Not here, my kitty cat. He's coming down to probably get some dinner. Let that sit. Might actually take the 40 minutes just to make the chicken. <laughs> uh, Ordered a case of commercial toilet paper from Amazon before the price jump. 12 9 inch nice. Uh, so, by price jump, how much did it go up? That's what I'm curious about. I'm grabbing a small tiny bowl of noodles real quick. And I'm gonna put a little bit of salt on it, not much, just a little bit. Got my candy fork. Yes, I think this is gonna help 
kind of negate some of that 40 minutes. Went for 40 to oh. That should be illegal. Just saying. Yeah, right now, people are selling Nintendo Switches for like $500 or $300. Even though they're a $300 console, it's fucking ridiculous. Like, you guys are absolute assholes. Mmm. Maybe a little bit too much salt, but you know what? I haven't done just noodles, butter, and salt for so long. Oh, that's so good. So simple. So much flavor. Mmm. Oh, we're good. Okay. Okay. Now that she's gonna tide me over until this is all ready. Which is gonna take a little while. Okay, let's turn that back up. I thought I heard Lovey. If he comes in, I'll probably have to go feed him. Whoops, I don't know what it clicked. I won't be surprised if there's a lot of other price gouging going on too. I got an email about someone going live and I do several people going live and I'm just like, I don't know who you are. Probably like a quarter of the notifications I get now, I know who the person actually is. Like, come on, send me actual people. So Put myself in, add this paprika, chili flakes, chicken broth, and crushed tomatoes. How much chicken broth does it need? Half a cup. Okay, so we might not need the whole thing of tomatoes. You use 99% pure isopropyl alcohol for your computer work. Good thing you have some. Oh, no kidding. Are you working from home at least now, though? Because then you don't have to, you shouldn't have to disinfect too much if you're just at home now. Just disinfect when you've gone out and stuff. Okay. Come on, keep on cooking, chicken. Keep on cooking. We got you. Um. So I have to get a quarter cup or half a cup of uh, chicken broth. I usually just estimate how much chicken broth that is. So we just have this container that's just full of powder. And it's supposed to be what one tablespoon per cup? One teaspoon per cup. So we're doing half. So probably about that much. About that much. You guys can't even see. That much. Not much at all. And then we just fill it up to half a cup. And you know, put water right next to my laptop. Okay, there we go. We've been social distancing since 2006. So you're a pro at this point. I totally added just some, a little bit more chicken broth into that. I'm going to stir it up with a fork real fast. I hate that noise. I hate that noise. Oh, I still didn't even grab the flour down with one even a little bit. I forgot about that. Well, we can get that down in just a little bit because it's not a right away type of thing. Pink's almost all gone. So it's definitely getting there. I'm going to add. Hi, Dread! How are you? So there's going to be half cup sour cream. Is that added in with? No. Sour cream is in its... So if sour cream and part of the sauce is on its own with flour. Why? Hey, Ducky! How are you guys? I'm looking at our recipe right now. There were 
pasta, rice, or potatoes. We already have the noodles cooked because I didn't realize this was actually supposed to set for 40 minutes once it has the sauce in it. That piece became from like 3 to 1. Okay, it looks like all the pink is out. Ducky is stalking you. You told me to fall. You cannot go anywhere without falling. You told me to. I believe Ducky. <laughs> okay, so add sweet paprika, which it's actually going to be smoked hot paprika. <laughs> uh, chili flakes, chicken broth, crushed tomatoes. So, paprika. <laughs> Man, lives matter. All lives matter. Dread. All lives. A little bit of chili flakes. That's that's probably good. Uh, you're also at the top of the most vulnerable list, unlike all of you youngins. Yes, Dread and Ducky too. All lives. I mean, okay. Let's not get into that too far. I guess. So let's let's just be careful with that. Not people who were. These are fucking fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> To. You knew I had to as soon as you said that. Oh, god damn it, Dread. <laughs> Ducky knows. Beanies are the best. You hope I get salmonella. Well, this chicken's gonna be cooked, so I think I'm probably safe. This is probably gonna be way too spicy with how much I added. I don't even care because it's gonna be good. Hopefully. It better be good. I really hope it's gonna be good. Okay, let's mix this up one more time. Actually, no, please don't. Yeah, no kidding. Are you gonna be around this Sunday? AKA tomorrow? Say, let's see. So 12 hours from now is 8 a.m. So then that's 16 hours. 18 hours from now. No! Damn it, Dread. No. 18 hours from now? You mean you are, but it's fucking complicated. Oh, I'm sorry. Why things gotta be so complicated? Now that makes me just think of that song. It's chicken broth, crushed tomatoes. So chicken broth going in. Oh, really? Sometimes it's hard to tell considering, like, you're usually going live when I'm offline. And Twitter, Twitter, Twitch only gives me some notifications, so. Do you mind if I ask why you're not streaming, or do you not want to talk about it right now? I'm not going to take off the beanie. You just have to deal with it. Got my, especially now since I probably have hat hair. Got the crushed tomatoes open. Okay, so it says 15 ounces is all we need. That's about half. 15 ounces, what the fuck is that? I don't know, it's ounces. Stop it! Okay, I kind of see why there might be a 40 minute cook time. I think I'm going to add probably some more of this uh, tomatoes. Just a little bit. Let's go a little bit more. Burp, 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 burp. Burp. There we go. Where is a paper towel so I can wipe this down? It's behind my laptop. What the fuck is that? It was crushed tomatoes. With, I believe, a bunch of seasonings in it. 
This was literally the only can of crushed tomatoes I could find in the store, so I had to get the large can. This looks really good. Thank you, Ducky. I am excited to try it because I've never had this. So I'm going to get you up to boiling. Okay. And then we're going to have to let this cook down for a while. So I guess we're just going to all hang out and chill. Actually, I might take off the hat. <laughs> Because I didn't, I didn't have a hat on because it's been kind of warm, actually. And plus I wear a hat all day, so. I had to at least, I had to at least annoy the hell out of Dread first. Imperial system can suck your <laughs> metric up. I don't, yeah, I don't know. I just, I just do what it, the recipe tells me. There we go. I gotta get, get the lid for this. Um, a snooty inchworm crawls by with its nose stuck up in the air. <laughs> Boo! Hello, Trin! How are you? Me <laughs> What the hell? I love you. Let me cover this and then I'll come feed you some your dinner. Let me go get let me get a lid for the thing. And I'll come get you some dinner. Where's my lids? In here. Where's my big lid? Down here. I know I'm horrible. What? <laughs> You're hungry? Make some food! Go make this. It's only going to take like two, an hour and a half. Alright, let me feed Love you real fast. Love you! You want me to you want some dinner? Hi! Okay, Lovey has been fed. Uh, you can't eat because you're fat. Oh, God, that sucks. Dread! <laughs> you guys are redeemed. Drink water. Sure! Okay, Dread. <laughs> Don't take it too far. <laughs> Wait, who who is, who is Minari? Is that a character or something? Boil, boil, something in Troil. I don't know. Mm. I could probably pull down the flour and probably throw away this crushed noodles. Let's throw up these noodles. Oh, come on, stir them up so they don't stick together too much. Separate, separate, separate the noodles. They'll probably they'll all come together by the end of this. I can tell you that right now. I'm probably going to use that crushed tomatoes for something. That sounds sad. No, it's actually not. I love her. She's such a penguin. I have never heard a phrase such a penguin. That's interesting phrase. Ooh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Look at that gloriousness. I just want to mix some of this together. That there's gonna be so many leftovers on this. I didn't realize it made such a big thing. Uh, he's just like a penguin. What does that mean? Because it's like there are these there are these guys that just go. Whoop, 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 whoop. Your phone is one percent. Oh no, your phone's gonna die. Mine's at fifty-seven. As soon as I looked down, it went from fifty-eight to fifty. Yeah, 
Run, run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me in the gingerbread man. That's fine. You have an How do you have another phone? Why? I still, I have my phone from like six years ago. Okay, this one's like three or four years old. She walks like, wait, so she walks like, I don't know if I can get far enough away. So she walks like meh, 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 like that. That's not how you spell charger. <laughs> no, it isn't charger. Why? <laughs> Jesus, Dread, you stop it. <laughs> I don't know. No, that doesn't keep them. I. <sighs> Eventually, I need to get everything like set up for this. Well, no, I can't on this laptop. Once I have the new laptop, wait, can I put my donut all over? <laughs> when she's being cute, she does. That's gonna boil for a bit. Okay, let's see if we can add the donut bowl on here. I didn't think about that. Where did the donation go? There we go. Add source. Add source. Hey, that's it! There it is! It's the dodo goal! Eventually you need to start wearing pants, but that day is not the way. I'm wearing pajama pants! Whenever I stream, they're not gonna be real pants. Why would- why would I ever do that? Cause that- that- that'd just be boring. Yeah, they are pajama- they're pajama pants! You're right, they are pajama pants with pajama bottoms. So yes. <laughs> My point still stands. Why would I ever wear regular pants? <laughs> okay, so oh I need to pull down flower. Keep forgetting to do that. And I probably put a lot of bolt and mix the noodles one more time again. They're so sticky. Oh, Chair. What? What the fuck? What? Flour. That is sugar. I don't want that. We have literally a ten-pound bag of sugar in our cupboard. Nah. Looks down at jeans. Yeah, regular pants are for losers. <laughs> Well, I just don't find jeans like comfortable and stuff. Like, with my, my stomach set and stuff. Okay, no wood. Carefully stir you guys all around a little bit. God, look at that. Listen to that sizzle. It's so good. That bubbly, bubbly. Uh. Uh. I don't like jeans because. Like the button, it pokes into my stomach, so I just don't like it. Jeans? Sad. You just bought three bags of sugar because they didn't have the 10 pounds. Why do you need 10 pounds of sugar though? It's so much sugar! It was the only one we, we bought it because it was the only one. Yes, jeans. You just got home out? Oh, just from work or what? You bake a lot. Okay, that makes sense. So, okay. Well, I guess Zach got his because baking a bit, recipes, and alcohol since he makes his own. Nope, store. Okay, get anything good at the store. Plus coffee. Ew. These are Satan's way of making us feel bad for eating literally anything. Yeah. That's why my jeans stretch. <laughs> you haven't worked in almost two. Holy crap. Is that from the COVID 19? Has it really been that long? Wow. That's insane. You have not worn jeans since 2006. I don't... I have a couple pair of blue jeans, but my my favorite one's a camo one. Stretchy jeans, best invention ever. Yeah, I was one of the first ones here out of... Damn. And it's not a work from home or anything. It's just kind of shit out of luck. Because that sucks. A lot. 
Oh my god, Duck, here's your fucking... Oh my god, that's so mean, Dread. And your governor extends things so till possibly mid-June for your... Right now, we're supposed to start phase one of opening up at the end of May. Yeah, so mean, Dread. So mean. Feeling sassy. <laughs> god damn it. Also, we're on a. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> you guys are just so. That's so bad. I can only imagine the things you're saying to each other then. But eventually, when I have a new laptop, I'll be able to have Discord open on my laptop again so I can talk to people. Wouldn't that be fun? Fuck you, laptop. You hate it. <laughs> but you seem to keep going back to them, Ducky, so. Don't worry, I do the same thing. Oh, look at that. Okay, I'm gonna turn this down just a wee little bit. Ooh, this might be getting actually close to done. This is sweet. This is looking so good. Pretty sure there's a lot more sauce in the video. Pretty sure I used a lot more chicken. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. I might just add sour cream rather than the flour. Just to make it more thick. But it's already getting pretty thick. Work? Question mark. Yeah, work. I still work. Which is cool, but also scary. Let's uh, translate that. <laughs> Someone needs to help. <laughs> needs to keep them under a bit of control. Think you mean has to try? I know. I need. I need to get like another. I need to. I needed a dread mod. That's what I need. A dread mod. Ducky, do you want to be a dread mod? <laughs> oh, that'd be so cool if you could make permissions. Like, I wonder if there's ways to make certain permissions. Like. So you can only allow people to do certain things, like, say I want a dread mod. I literally give you stuff that only controls dread, which would be so funny. You'll never miss dread until you actually need them. Mod. Whoops. Just be careful. Be warned. If you go too crazy, I will ban all of you. Alright, I still have, I've banned people and they've never been unbanned. I don't think. Actually, I think I unbanned a lot of them to see if they would come back. So far, none of them have. It's kind of disappointing. Yeah. <laughs> I think Dread's a uh, dread scare. This is, that is a huge mistake. I guess I'll find out. We're going to, it's gonna be a mod battle. Maybe maybe that'll be my new thing is come come for the show and stay for the mod battles. Can there be Oh my god, that'd be so much fun. Like somehow make like some sort of dude in Minecraft like gladiator battles of like if you win, you shall be the moderator for the day. <laughs> Have moderator battle, that'd be so fucking funny. Power hungry. Mod to the death. Best, best mod wins. I'm a mod in like 50 channels. Get on my level, son. I don't know you poops. I'm a troll. <laughs> if we didn't know you already, Bill, we'd, all, we'd be like, uh oh. <laughs> Actually, no. Now tell me, are the trolls the people who say they're trolls? Are are they the ones that you can't tell until they are tro too trolly? Sour cream has to cook. Okay. I'm just gonna stir this in here. I tempt banned a couple people for like a few seconds. Like I just muted them and they left and never came back. Can't say I hate it. I was kind of okay with it. Okay, I think one more good scoop. There we go. There we go. Oh, she 
Is that fucking food ready soon? You're hungry. It's almost there, actually. I need that tail of sour cream. This. I bought this this week. It's already halfway gone. <laughs> Maybe deep sauce by Tom Hardy. Let's make it deep. We should. Oh, God. I can't wait. Once we have, like, constant people, like, a lot of constant people, we're going to make a book. Straight up. Like, it's going to be the Twitch chat book. And it's going to be fun as hell. Because that, I think that would be fun. I don't know exactly how we'll do it. It'll be like each person, it'll have to be on like slow mode. And like each person is coming up with like a word or a sentence and we're putting it together. It doesn't have to make sense. We'll just make it the book by the Twitch community. <laughs> That's what you forgot. <laughs> oh no. Okay, so yesterday I was supposed I was supposed to make this yesterday. And I was all set up, ready to go, going through the list of ingredients, and the very last one, the very last ingredient on there was crushed tomatoes. So I started looking for the can. I'm like, and I remember going and buying crushed tomatoes. Actually. Yes. I remember going and getting putting crushed tomatoes in our cart. And so I'm looking for it, looking for it. And at the same time, my, uh, not realtor, but loan officer person, uh, called me. So I had to mute myself. Whoopsie. I am making a mess. I will clean it up. Called me. So I had to talk to her while I was looking for it on mute, on stream. Like 20 minutes looking and never found it. Buy, here's a pro tip, buy tomatoes. And, I would, but I think one of the reasons it does the canned tomatoes is like the sauce. I, I don't know why it's canned tomatoes. The canned tomatoes just work better for it, I think. Like, if a recipe says canned, I go canned. If it says fresh, I'll go fresh. Also, it takes so much time. Filled with cancer. I don't know about that. Where's the can? I have the can still. Let's see. What's it filled with? Tomato puree, tomatoes, salt, oregano, basil, thyme, black pepper, anise, citric acid, calcium chloride. I don't see cancer. <laughs> I don't know. You always make your own tomatoes? Damn. Here's another one. I don't like any I haven't. Have I ever made my own sauce for spaghetti? I think I made my own sauce for spaghetti once. There's no cancer! You guys are cancer! They're fine. You guys are fantastic. That looks delicious. I almost feel like... So I made noodles for this. I kinda wish I had done rice. Just a little bit. Wait, me or them? Oh, the, or that, I haven't, I haven't made my own. I said, I don't know if I've made my own or not. Now, I do know what the best canned one is. I will say that. I feel like this is, would be really good with garlic bread. I'm just going to do this. There we go. You missed the beanie. <laughs> I just, I don't always have the time for it. I, if, on the days that, like, Zach's off, we'll do something, like, big and special and stuff. But usually the days that we both work, I kind of keep it pretty simple. Because I'm pretty tired when I get home. Beanie or riot. What happens if you riot? I think the one good thing that I can control is who has power to turn my stream off and on. And the only, I think there's currently three people who have that power. My boyfriend, Grant, and Amber. I think that's the only three. 
<laughs> I think this is the only three I can trust, too. I love you guys, but you guys scare me sometimes. Doesn't this look delicious? One person. Is it Ducky or you? Because we could have used that last time when you fell asleep. I won't lie. That was funny as fuck. Oh, that was Ducky that said that. Sorry, I thought that was Dread that said that. Wait, so then who has it? Yeah, no, he still hasn't given me that. Yeah, which he should. Don't know what he's waiting on. Tisk, tisk, dread, tisk, tisk. If you cut some eye holes in that beanie and pull it down good, you can use it as a corona mask. I don't think it would go that far, and I never want to ruin that beanie. It is my favorite beanie. Okay, get some more water. Actually, and speaking of corona masks, I think tomorrow I'm supposed to get the elastic, so I'm actually going to be able to make start making masks again. Don't you dare change my title. Did you change it? I never thought I could look. <laughs> you better not have changed that title. <laughs> God. I didn't take that's the one power I need to take away from you. <laughs> Always changing my titles. Tisk tisk. Alright, let's get a good which I actually didn't change it for some reason. Get a good bite. I want green pepper. This looks delicious. Got some chicken, green bell pepper, noodles. Hmm. Oh yeah, that's pretty good. I actually could have added a lot more paprika and chili powder or pepper. I guess Twitch did it for me. <laughs> Ducky, you try. I want to see if Ducky tries and what happens if she tries. Because it should just be... Nope, doesn't work for you either. Huh. I wonder if they took that away from moderators and only gave it to uh editors now huh do editors get a special little blinky thing like you guys get i don't know game just yeah it needs hot sauce everything needs hot sauce um i don't know if i'd specifically throw hot sauce on it but it could use with a little bit more peppers jalapeno would be good in this Apparently Twitch has changed a lot of the moderator settings. Every Asian country needs a Bill's Burger joint. What, put spicy on everything? Yeah, I was kind of hoping this would be a little spicier. I didn't. I thought I'd put too much on, but I guess not. I know for next time. But it tastes good. The tomatoes are definitely there. What? Oh, good. Burgers. You're making me want burgers again. It feels a bit sour. I can kind of understand it because most people are ha bound to have a lot more mods than editors. So say if someone is pretty popular and has 20 moderators, that is now 20 people who can constantly change your title. That's a little, a little sketchy. So I can kind of understand it there. Nah, son. Well, no one can change your title. about them settings, yo. I don't know. 
I don't know how much Twitch has changed the, their stuff. Because I know they have a whole new uh, modding screen now, which is so fancy and so nice. Mm. Sort of this, so none will be a stuck. I don't know. I, maybe eventually I'll look at the settings. See if there's a set thing I need to change. Probably not. As long as they don't show across a certain point, they're fine. You know? It's up to them how they want to stream. Partners do make money for Amazon, as do affiliates. <laughs> and then they also make money. Not necessarily from Amazon, but from the people. We can do this. Stay positive. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, we don't make much, but we still a good chunk. I actually wonder how it compares to partners. Because there's definitely a shit ton more affiliates than there are partners at this point. So, I don't know how all the numbers work out. At this point, we all make Amazon money. <laughs> With how many Amazon buildings there is in Seattle, I'm surprised that they don't rename Seattle to the Amazon or something. Just, it's, it seems like it's literally only Amazon there. If you go in during like a normal work day. It's kind of crazy. Wait, really? That's kind of surprising, actually. Figured they'd be everywhere. You guys still get Amazon boxes, though, just shipped from over here or something, right? Or do you just not have Amazon at all? Because I'm pretty sure Amazon's a worldwide thing, isn't it? I've been on self dependent, but. What place is it that pretty much defeated coronavirus? Switzerland, I think? I think Switzerland. I don't remember. Oh, Italy does have us not beaten coronavirus. But there's been a couple places that have been able to like completely take control and be okay. Which is pretty impressive. Like, I think it was Switzerland. Like, they literally shut everything down for three weeks. Like, completely. Everyone had to stay home. Uh, and they had very strict rulings and stuff. Yeah. Excuse me. And fines. And after three weeks, everyone was able to go back and be fine. It's like, well, damn. Oh, um, I like that. I'll probably make this again. I wouldn't mind putting, like, some cheese in it. Your new cases have been going down every day for two weeks. Oh, good. Double-edged sword, though. Why is that? Because people will reopen too soon. And then it will go back up or something? Or... This is empty, right? Yes, that's empty. Explain the double-edged sword. Yes, yeah, less people get infected, but people will get infected later on. They can if you don't completely eradicate it. As long as cases in your state drop, you'll get to reopen, but all it takes is one person in Zoom. The vaccine is coming in the middle of next year, according to the World Health Organization. I hope... It It'd be cool if they were able to get it sooner, but I know they got to do a crap ton of testing and blah, 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 and blah, blah, blah. That's so long from now. I follow a female British streamer with Tourette Syndrome that always has a couple of thousand people in chat. She brought trolley tro trolling trolls to an art form. Uh, oh. 
I think I know who that is. I can't. <sighs> Crap. Because there's a video of her in a car with someone else that has. Yeah, sweet Anita. Yes, her. Because I didn't realize this was her. And I didn't know this was Teres when she did it. Uh, the video of her in a car with another dude, and they're driving, and he says, go right. And she's like, go left. It's like, or it's like, he says, go left. And she's like, go right. And it's like, go left, go right, go left. No, you fuck why go right. And she's doing it exactly in a Siri voice. Um, Sweet Anita is awesome. Sounds like Dora the Sweet Anita GPS. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? I give up. Huh? Yeet! Where are you going? Where are you going? That's not left. That's not left. That's not left. That's not left. Whoa! Turn left. Turn left. Turn left. That's not left. That's not left. Are you geographically retarded? Get out! Uh, I love that. Please exit the vehicle. Please, uh, please go fuck yourself. What? Are you what? But I can't, I can't find her. I can't find the one where she's in the car. Like, if you search on YouTube, I cannot find it. Um. Like they have a remix of it, but they don't have the actual video of it. You love your friend with Tourette's because they get. Oh. And for men feign legally, and he give that. Oh, that's, why? But that's for him, though. But yeah, that she. I love her. She's awesome. Apparently, her trigger word is banana, which is interesting. For him to take the prop is it supposed to help with the turrets? Cause I didn't know that was a thing. But alright. I think we're gonna start getting wrapped up because I'm starting to get super tired. So we're gonna see if someone's streaming real quick. Let's see if someone cool is streaming. Who are you people? Legend is, uh-oh. WWE Legend 28. Ooh, Horad! Horad streaming. But so is Grizzly Andrew. Modern Warfare. Subnautica. I haven't ever rated Grizzly Andrew. What? Did you hear me say I was tired? Because I literally said that not even two minutes ago. <laughs> it's like almost 8.40. I don't know who those guys are. Do I No, I do. I know who Legend is, right? Well, you're used to staying up at weird hours. Nope, god damn it. Oh, he's playing Days Gone, nice. It's gonna tell me something was gonna go down. Do you want me to do. Let's go visit Leggy. What? Who? Well, Legend? Wait, what do you mean, not anymore? He's streaming still. Right? Yeah, he's still streaming. 
No work means Doki gets to actually sleep at some point. Normal. Yeah, mine's my. I still have to go to sleep at like 8 and get up at 3 a.m. Alright. So, guys, thank you all for coming, hanging out, chilling with me while I make some delicious food. I know that I'd totally make this again at some point. Just probably add a bit more spiciness to it because it doesn't have as much as I was thinking. But yeah, we will be back tomorrow with Super Sleuth Sunday. I think we're going to do a Perler bead tomorrow. And I have a new lamp to make it look all better. Put those guns away. You don't have a license, or do I? I have a license to kill. Anyways, so guys, let's go raid Legend. Go say hello, and I shall see you guys tomorrow. Bye.